what's gonna happen with bonk token hopefully you're all doing fantastic today i do have some major announcements for you guys and that is that crypto is just getting started on this massive market rally but what about bonk like we gotta talk about the things i know about i usually don't make videos about things i don't know about and i think that's the huge problem with crypto right now like a lot of people they don't really know what they're saying but here on this channel we actually do know the things we talk about like we say the things we talk about and we basically explain them fully so that's something you want to be kept up to date smash that like uh i do have some major announcement for you guys pretty much soon but the reasoning why i'm so excited is because bonk has been seeing massive drops and this is exactly as i predicted uh, and this youtuber called cryptolution actually said there's going to be a massive rally after and i want to see if he still stands by the same thing he's been saying it for like yeah don't worry guys we're going to be seeing massive rally after this huge crypto uh prediction there's going to be more more updates so don't worry that's exactly how he was saying it and i think there's a possibility of that happening but again this is a big problem right now for all bonk holders because the bonk holders bought just after the Binance listing. So if you want more content like this, smash that like button. I'll keep you guys updated. I definitely do think there is um, potential up more profit to be made with bonk, but I don't know when. I don't know how the bull run will ha happen. So I think this is the the big the big drop that everybody was waiting for. So this is what I'm kind of worried about. But again, look, it's just the start of the crypto run is just the beginning there's tons of more opportunities in that space and i do think there's going to be ton more so that being said if you guys like this you know if you like bonk uh it does seem like that it's not over for it but it does seem like some people are leaving some people are taking profit it's a 30 percent increase of what this is a massive massive run a massive rally and i think a lot of them they can't really sustain this so um, we saw in 30 days, we saw 300% increase, uh, seven day drop of 26%. So obviously we predicted this type of crash. Not only that, you've also seen Solana take a dip. Remember Solana actually touched a hundred dollars is down 4%. So I definitely think that what you're saying with the Bonk token is following the correlation of Solana. So if Solana takes a dip, so will Bonk and many other all. Again, he said it very well. As long as Solana takes a dip, so will other tokens in that sense. Um, and Bonk is the one to really take the hit because a lot of people sold the Bonk phone. So there was like a Solana a Saga phone that a lot of people ended up selling. Like they didn't want to hold any of it. Why would they? they? They just resold it for profit, right? Because if you got the bonk airdrop, like activating this phone, I guess activating the number, um, you got a crypto airdrop. And I think you got some starring crypto, like maybe for some fast fa gas fees, you got some Solana, which I find pretty cool. Don't get me wrong. But um, people didn't really want to stay on it. People didn't want to stay around. And I think this is where people sold bonk. They found out um, they were giving very high APRs. I think they were giving three percent per day so in 30 days you would have made all your money back and this is why bit whales are selling because they're probably making three percent a day uh for nothing if they're staking on this uh bonk if they're staking their bonk they're making three percent a day let that sink in guys this isn't sustainable three percent coins within the Solana ecosystem. So it's not just the Bonk token. So to keep that in mind, right? So maybe Bonk is taking a dip, like maybe four or 5%, and then it's also dipping another 5% with Solana. So keep that in mind. Okay, let's go into the charting and analysis because we don't want to waste any time. Okay, we always update our chart whatever we see within the price action. It's not just one charting style or one technique forever it's you always have to adapt what's going on in the market now what's really interesting is that if you see this ema ribbon it's really this price is just holding steady it's hovering around one nine for so long for so many days it's been yeah, so it's been seeing basically a huge dip before the massive crash and i think this is where the problem rose like it really didn't see much and i i was kind of expecting it because if if bonk didn't like see this recovery there was no recovery in that sense like bong saw a massive price crash because there wasn't much to recover from like you cannot sustain this because this is like the binance listing we do have more listings but nothing can beat the binance listing all the tokens have crashed after crypto failing and i think that's the big problem that's the big problematic factor here like a lot of people will just get end up giving up on on crypto in that sense there is 
opportunities, tons of opportunities arising in the crypto space. But I do think Solana seeing like such a big drop, we could have seen so much more like from Solana. Like there is just a little time, too little time to actually say what's going to be happening with, with, with Solana. But if you guys want to be kept up more today, subscribe for more. No price action over here. It's actually right down there. So again, we don't actually know. So really, this is something I want to share with you, which is my perspective. You must be wondering, should you buy more or should you sell everything? Now, everybody's position is very different. Some people just spend $100. Some people spend thousands of dollars. And sp some people spend way more than that on this token. But the most important thing that I want to share with everybody that I share on this channel repeatedly over and over is take, pro I think I would say take profits, like taking profits on this would be actually a massive gain for anyone in the crypto industry right now, because the crypto markets are a bit unstable. So if you can have sustainable like profits and everything like that, then you can finally realize, okay, maybe crypto is not going to be seeing these type of bull runs. Maybe I should take a small dip, small profit. And I think this is where the the opportunity like is going to go up in that sense for a lot of these crypto holders. But again, um, I do think crypto markets will recover. Crypto markets will see some more traction. So but Bonk does have more to see here, but not as much as the all time high. That's for sure. It could be seeing a 10 percent gain or even not dropping is pretty good put as much as you can that you feel is necessary to not give you a panic attack and also that you feel you just have enough exposure in that no matter what happens with with the price volatility you will have fun regardless so if this thing goes to zero it won't be a complete loss to you but if this thing goes all the way up to the moon then you're going to have absolutely a lot of fun and you're going to take in those substantial gains so keep this in mind this token even though it's in the billion dollar market cap does have the possibility of flipping Shiba Inu's market cap, which is at its all time low. So yeah, it is possible that we will see a high, high reward. And I th think I'm very excited for that, honestly. Like there could be tons of opportunities in this crypto space, growing up, getting out there, uh, ship, it could flip ship. I'm not saying it will, but it could. And I think that's the the promise. Like people are willing to take these chances, the promise of, of, of ship flipping. Uh, I'm pretty excited for that. Now, the question is, are you? If you guys want more content like this, smash that like button. As you can see, I'm pretty tired today, but that won't stop me from making some awesome content for you guys. And as always, if you want more, you know where I'm at. I'm right here. I'm not going anywhere. And yeah, peace, everyone.